Nikopi, here with the Let's Play of the Great Ace Attorney, the Adventures of Ryus Ryunosuke Naruhodo. <laughs> yes! Wow, wow, that's some Japanese sounding Ace Attorney names, aren't they? <laughs> well, there will be seen too many, uh, too many punny names in this one. But yes, guys, yes. We are heading back into another Ace Attorney game, and uh, much sooner than I expected, honestly. <laughs> I thought it would be uh, like a long time since there's no uh, game after Spirit of Justice has been announced. But uh, these games uh, have only been released uh, in Japan, and they don't seem to be ever getting localized here in America. So, uh, the people over at, uh, Scarlet Study took it upon themselves to go and translate, uh, the first of, uh, two games. There's this one, and originally it's called, uh, it's like Dai Gyakuten Saibin or something, which is, or DGS for short. So it's DGS 1 and DGS 2. And they've just, uh, recently finished, uh, this game. So I thought, you know what? It's been a little while since I've done, last done an Ace Attorney game. Might be a good time to hop back in it, and from what I've heard, there I've heard a lot of really good things about this game. Also, it is made by the same guy who made the original trilogy, as well as Apollo Justice, so that actually makes me a little more excited, too. Because I think I like those games better than some of the newer ones, for the most part. Now, I know some of you might be like, well, Nico, aren't you already doing a visual novel? And it's true, I don't normally do uh, two types of the same kind of game at the same time. I try to usually mix it up, um, but... I figured since the, for the other series I am doing, well, I, I'm leaving the voices on, the Japanese voices, and not really doing any voices myself, which was definitely split the audience a bit, you know? You guys were super split on whether you want me to keep them on or turn them off. So I figured this will be, you know, for those people who want to actually hear my voices, you know? I haven't really done a good voicey game in a while, have I? So uh, I think this uh, might help scratch that itch for some people, and let me uh, get to pull out my voices and start flexing them skills again. Hey, you know what? I'm really honestly excited about this game. I'm excited because I think it's it's gonna be nice to get a bit of a fresh start uh, with Ace Attorney. I, I'd already expressed to you guys at the end of Spirit of Justice, while I did, for the most part, enjoy Spirit of Justice, uh, I still felt that the game was becoming too stagnant, that things were feeling too familiar, too many turn the case around moments, and just like, it felt like it was hard for them to find any more progression for Phoenix. Like he just felt so unnecessary anymore. And I just, uh, I'm hoping that this game will help maybe bring some more life back in the series and make me excited about it again. But yes, I was uh, actually very fortunate because uh, one of the uh, uh, moderators in the Discord, uh, OKK, I uh, was actually a part of the Scarlet Study Project, uh, the people who were responsible for uh, translating this game. So a big thank you to, uh, first, the, the whole Scarlet Study team to going out of the way to translate this this game, which, by the way, I'm playing the Android version, uh, playing on an emulator, so... Uh, but I do have a legal copy of the game. I It was very complicated, but we did eventually uh, manage to get to work, thanks to both OKK as well as a uh, random browser big. Thanks to you guys big. Thank you to Scarlet study put all the time into this I, I can imagine just what a massive undertaking that was But I decided to go with the Android one because it actually believe it or not ends up looking a bit better than the uh, The 3ds version of the game so which kind of surprised me I thought it would probably end up not looking as good. I usually think I like phone games that I would think eh, probably not as uh as uh, good looking, but uh, surprising these days, you know, phones are phones are powerful now. For I can tell you too, I don't think I can actually use like my controller on this. So I think I have to stick just the touch controls, which will take a little getting used to. But yeah, so we got the Adventures of Renosuke Ryun Naruhodo, which I guess means that uh, the team didn't try to change any of the original names, like you know, changing. I can't really remember what Phoenix's actual Japanese name was. No, 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 no. His his last name was Naruhodo as well. Some, but something else, not Ryunosuke. Because from what I heard, this is supposed to take place, this is a flashback, and you're supposed to be controlling a uh, ancestor to Phoenix Wright. So, interesting. Okay, so a different time period. I wonder if it'll be a different time period, Judge. Oi, mate, it's me, Aussie Judge. I'm gonna tell you cunts how to write the right way to do a judge it. Yes, yeah, exactly how that would go. I'm not really sure what this game is supposed to take place, but... So yeah, I hope you guys are okay with me doing two visual novel-y kind of games. Although I will say, that compared to Steinsgate, this one has much more gameplay, like gameplay elements, than uh, 
uh, Steins Gate, which really is just kind of making choices, you know, p choosing to pick up your phone and not, while basically going through the story. You can actually get a game over in this, while in Steins Gate, it's just a, a ending that is one of the branches, right? And like I said, I get to whip out some voices. Maybe I can get some new ones here. I'm trying to think if I, if I want to get this guy, like, the, just the Phoenix voice, because he's his ancestor, but uh, I don't know. I kind of have to see him first. See how much he is like him. Uh, I'm hoping we don't run into any issues with playing this game, just because uh, I heard them say, you know, they, they've they done it for the Android, but not an emulator of the Android. So I'm hoping that do not run into any problems, but uh, I think it'd probably be okay. So, all right, guys. Well, uh, without further ado, let's get started. God, I hope there's not a Larry Ancestor in this game, right? That will automatically ruin this whole fucking experience for me. Look at this stud muffin here. Oh! Ooh, hey, we can get animated uh, scene here. Nice. We're not longer in Japan, Fortnite guys. We're in real Japan. I wonder how they would have localized this. How would they have gotten away with it? Oh, shot to shit, dead. Holy crap, the head on that guy. So she did you want to shit. That's supposed to be my guy, right? Why did I kill somebody already? Dude, we just started the game. Episode 1, The Adventure of the Great Departure. Holy shit, that- <laughs> da -da 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 -da. Ah, oh god, each, the, each letter is a gunshot to my heart. 22nd no November, 843, Supreme Court, Fennel Lobby number five! <laughs> okay, we're still doing that, at least. All right, well, I am in straight up Japan now, so we're not we're not beating around the bush anymore. No Japan of no hamburgers. Here, hamburgers, Apollo, no, none of that crap. We're here. All right. Uh, even now, I find it hard to believe. While everything seems so calm in this lobby, just one step beyond. Why is the grand bench where my fate will be decided? Hey, similar sounding sounds, but not quite the, the same. Ah, oh, cool. This definitely feels more, uh, you know, akin to like Spirit of Justice's uh, graphical style, which is which is good. Um, and what do you want? Uh, it's me, right? I like. Uh, oh, choose where you want to save. I will save here. Uh, okay, let's try to figure out the UI here. Uh, where's my stuff at? Oh, ah, I clearly decided I just kept the message going. Fair me won't do you any good, you damn murderer. <laughs> I said nothing, right? Yeah, okay, so if I, if I click anywhere, the message is gonna go. Um, like my, I saw the guy initially, and my English, because he actually looks more, he looks more like Apollo than fucking Phoenix to me. I wish I could make like a British voice. I, I don't know, I mean, I mean, I'm clearly in Japan. I think. British Japan, I I don't know. I don't know if I should go like a, give everyone kind of an English sort of posh accent. I don't think I can whip out a book or anything anywhere. Let's try like a British Apollo. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go with that for a little bit, okay? Let me just, I, I got a feel for it. That's how it always goes at the beginning. Sorry. Narahodo. My name is Ryunosuke Narahodo. I'm a second year student in the Imperial Yume. University of the Empire of Japan. Okay, now very Japanese. Uh, okay, that's probably not gonna work then. The Phoenix work was voice was always a weird one. It was, I mean, we got used to it, but it was a fucking weird choice that I, I picked for Phoenix. I don't know if that's gonna work for this guy either, though. Uh, three days ago, it's like that. Probably, I don't want to my Apollo always to be my go-to voice. It's it is very protagonisty sounding and it works, but I also don't want to. Beat a fucking dead horse. Like, can I think of something different? Three days ago, I was caught up in a terrible incident. Maybe if I take the the Apollo bait and just bring it down like a, 
a little bit, so it's a bit deeper. Three days ago, I was caught up in a terrible incident. And now, I await my judgment. HALT! Holy mother of Japanese. Uh... Bailiff! <laughs> uh... Ah! This is gonna be hard! I don't know how this will! Uh... Uh, just gonna go with Edgeworth for now. Bail if I say it's about time you send the flow of garbage coming through your mouth. Ha! Ah! I'm Japanese Edgeworth! Excuse me? Who, who do you think you are? I'm... Oh. I'm the defense attorney for the, the defendant before you. Ha! I'm gonna... That's why I'm playing a defense attorney! Defense attorney, you say? You told us today's tr... Uh, actually, maybe I should give him the Phoenix voice. Maybe that would be funny. Ah, you know, let's go with that. I like that idea. I'm not sure eventually I'm going to be the defense attorney, right? I, I think. I think that's how this game works. Until today is, today's trial is ended, until the verdict has been passed. You have no right to call this man a criminal. Holy fuck, I've got a sword. Watch your words, man, if I will cut your head off! <laughs> Arrogant little know-it-all. You and your stupid logic. Your logic! At least I'm capable of making logical arguments, unlike you. Don't you agree, Ryunosuke Naruhodo? Huh? Whoa! Sorry about all that. Okay, I seem kind of goofy, don't I? Why are you apologizing to me? No, uh, never mind. Hmm, okay, no, he's, he's, he's much goofier. Uh, okay, maybe not deep then. Maybe I gotta go higher. Is this like a Lucas voice? Would that would that work? Would that be a little too high? <sighs> it's like, <laughs> then just pick the Apollo voice. But come on, come on, I got more in me than that. Uh, never mind. Yeah, yeah, let's try, let's try maybe the like a little bit of higher, sort of maybe like Lucas. Let's try that. All right, let's give it a, give it a go. He's kind, he seems kind of goofy, and he's young, right? I'm really sorry, Asogi, for giving you so much trouble. Asogi? <laughs> ah and at the end, you still apologize. You never change. I guess not. Lately, your name is in every paper in the capital. Imperial Yume st University professor killed. The culprit, a student of the same university. Look at his bandana just ever infinitely flowing in the wind. It's not even breezy in here. And yet, you didn't do it, did you? Yeah, of course not. You have to believe me. I, I, I didn't kill him. I'm not a murderer. Stop hanging your head. Head. Chin, chin up. Back straight. Uh, Asogi. I believe in you. Ryunosuke Naruhodo. Naruhodo. This is my best friend, Kazuma, Kazuma Sogi. He's a second year student like me. But to be frank, he and I are worlds apart. He's the pride joy of our university. Even though he's still a student, he's already qualified to be a defense attorney. Whoa, look at that pose. You're too kind. Oh God, you can hear my thoughts. Defense attorneys are still an emerging profession here in Japan. We are but a meager existence in the judicial system, at least for now. Oh my God, this is where it all begins. I know I already said this three days ago, but... Nosogi, you're as your friend, and I couldn't be more proud of you. Three days ago. That's right. That was when it, it happened. It. Ah! Congratulations, Nosogi! You've finally been approved to study abroad! Yes, I've, I've finally done it! Feels like a dream come true. Seems like the government has recognized my achievements as both a student and a lawyer. You'll be studying the greatest legal system in the world as a representative of Japan. As your friend, I couldn't be more proud of you. There is an assault at Yume University who doesn't know Asogi's name. Wherever he goes, a mysterious warm breeze follows. So the rumors, tr so the rumors say. For the sake of reforming this country's legal, legal system, I want to observe a true legal system across the sea with my own two eyes. The British Empire! The British Empire? Man, I, I wish I could see it. Then why don't you come with me? It would bring me great pleasure to rampage through the Queen's Domain with you. You make it sound so easy. Oh, look at the time. How do you going? I'll stay a bit longer. We did come all this way after all. 
You're right. You're right. Really, the chance to visit a high-class establishment like this. Well then, take care. See you tomorrow's English lecture, partner. And then he faded away. Shortly afterwards, it began. It began. Uh, Mr. Sogan, a, mo a moment, please. What do we have now? Aha! Japanese man and Japanese woman. <laughs> That's the reason why this never got localized, because they're like, there's no fucking way. These people are in fucking Japan. You, you can't say it any other way. And maybe they think that people wouldn't be as interested if it, they didn't think it was Japanifornia? What? Professor, I, I didn't expect to see you. Well, well, I can't say this isn't and doesn't concern me. More importantly, you ought to go and see the judge in his chambers. The judge? He's been looking for you qu for quite some time. He took on the role of a defense attorney without much warning, as you forget. As a result, today's proceedings seem to be in a bit of disarray. Who is this gentleman? I feel like I've seen him around the university before. Understood. I'll be there at once. Allow me to accompany you. Well then, Naruto. I'll see you in the courtroom. Ever so expressive. Right. I'm counting on you, Soki. Get me off for this shit. I didn't murder nobody. That old man deserved to die. <laughs> Hi there. Huh? Wow. This is awkward. Excuse me. Y yes Are you Rinosuke and Naruhodo, the defendant in today's trial? Y yes, that's me. I'm Eugen Eugen Miko to Toba, the professor of forensic pathology at Yumi University. P professor Miko Taba Toba. I've heard that name from Sogi. He's the one who tirelessly lobbied the government to let Sogi study abroad. Asoga has informed me that you are his best, his best friend. He said that about me? If that's true, there's something you must know. What is it? As you are aware, Asoga is set to study abroad in the, the British Empire. However, in the event that he loses today's trial, his trip will be suspended. He will never receive an opportunity again. What? Damn! You really didn't know, then. I suspected that Asogi would have wished to hide the truth from you. So Asogi's defending me despite the risk. Wait! Why would they, they do that to him? Our government chooses who gets to study abroad from a wide pool of candidates. Let's just say that to receive such a privilege is no laughing matter. But... Still... I... I swear, I didn't do it! I'm not a murderer! Oh, of course. However, I must warn you, it will be quite difficult to prove your innocence. You see, today's trial is... special, to say the least. <laughs> oh, music and real! Huh? What do you mean by that? You'll find out once the trial begins, whether you like it or not. Then, what on earth should I do? Keep this in mind. I'm not asking you to just stand by there, stand there and accept a guilty verdict. Huh? As soon as the trial begins, the judge will pose a certain question to the defense. To the qu this question, you must reply, I am, before anyone else has a chance to speak. I am? Oh, am I, re are you representing yourself? before, what, the other guy comes up? Hold on! What kind of question is this go going to be? Oh, no way. It's going to be something like, who is the killer? <laughs> no, of course not. You idiot! Uh, defend, defend and get your ass in here! Trial's about to start! Make your way to the courtroom at once! Alright, Larry, guard. Oh my, it's time. Because our, our secret talk must end here. In any case, I shall leave you with these words. Kazuma Sogi must not stand as the defense attorney in today's trial. 
Uh, oh, okay. Of course, the one who ultimately decides that will be you, the defendant. Ah, oh, I see. Okay, that's how I was gonna. That's how I'm gonna get pushed into all this shit. What are you waiting for? You want me to hold contempt of court and declare guilty for even get in the room, dummy? Kind little turn won't be much help anyway. So move it. If we lose today's trial, not only will I be found guilty of murder, Asogi will lose his chance to study abroad too. And so, blissfully unaware of what lay ahead. I headed off to the trial. It's time. That fateful trial, one I'd never forget. Never forget whatever it was about. Number 22nd, 9 a.m. Spring court. Court room. Court two! Court two! Not court number two. Ah! Oh my god, my eyes! Holy shit, I'm fucking blazing right now! No, 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 I told you not to do all that blow before this trial. I'm sorry, I'm a little, just a little wound up. It helps calm me down. Oh, God! God damn it, your panda is still blowing. Why is it still blowing? So this is the courtroom. Oh, God. Ah! Ah! Not a any courtroom. This is the Supreme Court, the highest legal authority in the Empire. Mm, something feels off about the gallery. Just a bunch of faceless, no-name NPCs. Why are there so many people in uniform? Today's trial is being conducted in absolute secrecy by order of the government. Absolute secrecy? That's what I said. The general public has no idea that this trial is taking place. The only ones allowed to be in attendance are military and government officials. Huh? B why? You'll find out soon enough. More importantly. Time to focus, Naruto. It begin it's about to begin. Oh my god! Oh holy shit! Hey, guys! Oh, it's not like we went back in time. Look who's looking young and fucking sexy as shit! Oh! Oh my god, I am. Look, guys! It's the original young version of me! Yep, that's right. I've been alive for like 30 fucking centuries. Oh my god, this guy looks cool as shit. Actually, look, based on his appearance, he look, I probably could probably give more of what I gave the uh, foreign judge in Spirit of Justice. I don't think crazy old man judge is gonna work for him. The court is now in session for the trial of Ryunosuke in Naruhodo. Yeah, it works. I can do that. Ah! <laughs> ah! It's me! Okay, but this guy, he gets the fucking max pay voice, because come on, he has to. It's it's literally him. Hey, guys! That's right, you get a tutorial version of me back here! I'm Max Crane's Payne's great 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 granddaddy! Oh, my hair gets blown off by the end of this! Here we go! Rasky she's ready, your honor! I mean, ah! <laughs> it looks so nervous. As is the defense. Before we proceed, there is one thing I would like to confirm. Last night I received an urgent request for change of attorney from def the defense. Yes, your honor. It was I who submitted that, that request. Custom dictates that an attorney ought, ought to be appointed two days before the trial. Therefore, I must ask for confirmation. Who is to stand as the defense for the accused in today's trial? Oh, here we go. Here it is. The opening question. Gah! In other words, who will be defending me in this trial? If I answer I am, that would mean... Uh, you... There's no time to think. I should wait and see what ha wait and see what happens. Well, so he's the real lawyer. I can't really defend myself. It's his game anyway, right? I'd be lying if I said I am. Yeah, lying is bad, but being labeled a murderer would be even worse. Uh -huh. No road, no stop fidgeting. It's distracting. Just say it. Say it. Say it. But if I don't answer here, no, I might end up ruining everything for him. Your Honor, there is no need to confirm. Needs to say, the one who will be defending the accused is. <laughs> Hi! I I am. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, no, take that or gotcha or hold it. Oh, that out of place, yo. What do you? What is that, sir? The the one who will be defending the accused is me. 
Ryunosuke Naruhodo! What? Ah! <laughs> Alright, so I got his judge. Ah! What do you think you're doing, Naruhodo? Yeah, we took too long! Professor Mikatoba told me everything. Coming down? If, if I'm declared guilty, your study of Brawl will be suspended. I'm disappointed. You're saying that you don't trust me at all. You think that if I was your attorney, we would lose this trial? N no, absolutely not, but I'm scared of that other guy. I'm a scared! There's a chance that you... because of me. I knew it. I knew you'd pull something like this. That's why I kept my mouth shut. Damn it. Professor Mikotoba. This is completely unnecessary. Alright, well, you're, uh, it's your funeral, kid. Very well. The court acknowledges that the accused will defend himself in today's proceedings, so this should be a quick one, guys. I'd say we'll be wrapped up at about 10. <laughs> I've got a fan now! I look so fucking oriental this game! Look at my big old arms like I got fucking Saiyan armor on. Oh, I see. I even got the Max Payne mannerisms. By renouncing his attorney, the accused is admitting to his own crime. This actually honestly looks better than even uh, the Spirit Justice game. Like, this looks really fucking good. Just like the, the graphics. Giggy Eddie! Giggy Eddie! Oh, Jackson! Do not misunderstand. The one who is most sure of his own innocence is simply the defendant himself. That's all. Isn't that right, defendant? Ha! Hurry on! Ha! Yeah! Th that's right! I'm not on it! I'm fine! <laughs> but if I'm being honest... <sighs> this defendant is drawing to a total blank on what to do next. First of all, do something about those shifty eyes of yours. Stop like you're Elliot! Like huh. I'm gonna cut you down to size, little man! How dare a mere student bother the great Supreme Court with such a trite case? Oh, ho, ho, ho. surely I'm not the only one who was outraged by this arrangement, right? As you gentlemen know, this is the great bench of the Supreme Court. As such, we demand a trial befitting this courtroom, the pinnacle of our legal system. The defendant, defendant? Y yes! I shall now gauge whether or not you are qualified to stand in this court. Can you yell objection real loud? Yeah, yes! Okay, you pass. Oh, okay. What's he gonna do? In other words, the judge announced that you have the ability to properly defend yourself. Chokes on him, because the person with the most doubts is none other than myself! Ha ha! Ha ha, uh. Now, I shall pose some simple questions to the defense regarding this case. Do you know how to bring out your inventory? Y yes your honor! First, what is the name of the victim of this murder? Answer properly and clearly. Okay, I should know this one. I've heard countless times since the incident. I think. It's... Huh? Oh no, I'm so nervous. I can't remember. What? What was his name? Again? Naruto. Naruto! You're drawing a total blank on this one, right? Ah, uh, you're my best friend, all right. You're my best friend, Nasugi! Don't worry, everything about the incident is logged in your core record, you idiot! Open up your core record! I don't know where it is, I don't see it in my UI anywhere! The court record, the fuck is that? This is like pre, pre, pre Ace Attorney, alright? This shit's fucking new! <laughs> there it is! Go ahead and touch the court record button in the top right corner. Go ahead, touch it! Nasugi, touch my button! Okay, I'm gonna do it! I, I'm touching the button, it's not doing anything! And there you'll find everything you need. Here are things you may have forgotten. Great. Let's try tapping the core record button. Here we go. There. Ah! Oh my god, that's my school badge. Wow, it looks like a ninja star now. That, how very Japanese-y. How appropriate. Here's all the evidence. You can also view the profiles of people involved in the case. Died after 2 p.m. Was shot in the chest and bled to death. Bull did not pass through the body. Okay. If the one is a student of Imperial Yume University, always on school uniforms. Hey, it's you! Once you convert the victim's details, press back to return to the task at hand. Kazuma Sugi, 23, second year student at the Imperial Yume University. Has a great talent as a lawyer, despite just being a student, my best friend. Uh, 
Yujin Mikotaba, Toba, professor at Imperial Yume University's Medical Research Department, an authority in forensics medicine, and Asogi's mentor. Ha! Takesuchi Ouchi! I'm sure the, the official translation would have been something pain, right? Japanesey pain here! Samurai pain here in the house! Prosecutor investigating this case. Appears he does not prove what cultural alignment has done to society. Oh, look at this posh fellow here. John H. Watson! Wow, that's the... Now look at that English name. And everybody else, and then this guy's just fucking John H. It's fucking Watson, is it? Oh, he's a victim in this case. was invited from the mission bar to the university. Oh my god, is this Watson from Sherlock Holmes? He killed him? He's a medical doctor, too. He's dead. Oh, we're piece of information we found in the court record. Remember that. Now we should keep his honor waiting. Present your answer. Just the problem, the victim. Present to the court. All right, it's you, obviously. <laughs> I've been kind of tempted to do that, or present it as this guy, but it'd probably just be like, that's wrong, and I, I want a funny answer. Hi! Hi! Sir, the victim is Dr. John H. Watson. Yeah, I actually look a lot older than any other Max Payne, to be honest. Despite this being a flashback. Of course, you would remember the name of a professor at your own dumb university. You stupid asshole. Dr. Watson was a medical doctor in the British Empire. Three years ago, he was invited to teach at the Imperial Univer Yume University. And that is why we have such a tremendous de debacle on our hands. The British Empire. The British! The British! A country with which the Empire, Empire of Japan wishes to maintain strong diplomatic relations. Recently, after lengthy negotiations, our two empires signed a new treaty. The Japanese Anglo Treaty of Commerce and Navigation. That's a mouthful. Everyone knows about it! Right, 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 right. Yes! I mean, I, I mean, yes! Ha! You knew that, and yet you still took the life, the life of a British! Oh, life of a British! What's more, your students at your Imperial Yume University yourselves! Fuck you! You murdered a professor of an institution of learning! Have you no shame? Yeah, but I didn't do it. Due to the grave nature of this incident, we have drawn the attention of the British Empire. They have requested that the Supreme Court pass swift judgment in today's trial. Huh. In other words, our spineless government is bending over backwards to appease the Brits. What the fuck? You're just being used as a convenient scapegoat for that. Is that what makes this trial so special? Exactly. Our country must find someone to punish as soon as possible. All because the victim is a Brit. The jolly old Brits, called damn doodly. The British man, Dr. John H. Watson. And you think this has nothing to do with our countries or that treaty? I was just in the wrong place at the wrong time. Hi Oh, would you look at the time? I have to get going soon. I'll stay a bit longer. I came all this way after all. You're right. We really get the chance to visit a high-class establishment like this. Well then, take care. I'll see you tomorrow's English lecture, partner. Off to the British Empire, huh? What a guy. Oh? Hey, there's a guy I want to kill. Ha <laughs> just, just snap his fucking neck. Ah! I see that man on campus before, I, th I think. He's that doctor from Britain. Never got his name, though. Maybe I should go introduce myself. I really regret, regret doing this later. And so... I went to Dr. Watson's table to introduce myself. Now, let's just move on to the next question. <laughs> yes, your honor! How was Dr. John H. Watson robbed of his life? Present the cause of death to the Supreme Court now! Do it! Do it now, Apollo! <laughs> I'm not Apollo, is that? Dr. Watson's cause of death. Of course, that would be. Now, Rhoda, this is a court of law. We will let the evidence speak for itself. The, the evidence? How do I do that? Evidence can't talk, sir! Quickly, present the piece of evidence and show you the doctor's cause of death! No, uh, uh, clearly, I gotta present my school match! 
Got a strike. I press up my badge everywhere, right, guys? Just like in all the other games. Boom. Hi! Hi! Take that! Um. Uh. According to this thing, it was blood lost from a gunshot wound, Your Honor. Um. Uh, is this. Uh. Oh, wait. This is my grocery list. Never mind. At least call my property, you dickhead! That thing is a postmortem report! Yes, the postmortem thing at Inger. Not thing at her! In the West, for example, in the British Empire, corpses undergo what's called an autopsy. Ew, sounds gross. In our country, police surgeons conduct a postmortem examination instead. Right, that's totally different, <laughs> I guess. It's like the same thing, just different ways. Say, shut up, whatever. Now I get it. I don't get it at all. Ah! Was I studying at this school? <laughs> Did I learn anything? Allow me to present a photograph of the crime scene. Ah, oh, shot to shit, boom. As you can see, there's gunpowder burns around the bullet hole, meaning you was shot in point blank, bitch. The victim was shot at point blank range. There's no other conclusion. Very well. The court accepts this modern investigation tool as evidence. Yes, thank you. Wow, this is a photograph. Holy shit. Man, now imagine if I could just squeeze this into a small little device and play fucking Angry Birds on it. It's my first time seeing one. It captures far more detail than what you'd expect from an il illustration. Stop gazing at that fucking picture! Ah! Very well, you have proven to yourself to the court. The question gets there. Ah, that's really it? That's really all it takes to be a lawyer here? Yes, that's good enough. Just to make sure you uh, make sure you are paying enough attention to lose gracefully. Thanks, Your Honor. All right. Well, anyway, I've got my turkey sushi <laughs> ready to eat here. Oh, uh, really? Yeah, that's right. Japanesey, isn't it? We're really gonna do that here? Why the fuck not? I'm his ancestor. I have I like turkey, but I like it in rolls instead. I don't really hear much actually about turkey sushi roll, but you know what? F whatever. The point is, I like sushi. Now let's proceed with the trial. Ha, Tipos! Ha! <laughs> Understood, Your Honor. Yes, I am preparing to draw my blade. I'm gonna. I am now Blackwell in this fucking universe. What the hell? That's right. I went from being the lamest to the most badass attorney here. You gotta die today, Your Honor. <laughs> Why am I scared of Max Payne? First, I would like to give an overview of the incident. Ha! I hereby summon a witness who was present at the crime scene and isn't the killer. I promise. I swear to God. Okay. This is the first time we're doing this. There's no way I'm going to set a precedent today. Oof. Oof. Here we go. Huh. Just realized what the professor had in mind. Professor Miko Toba, you mean? You knew that you'd be the one defending yourself in court. However, as long as I stand by your side, I can still offer you advice. I'm your tutorial. I understand now. You're my partner, Button. Oh, that's true. Or my Maya! Here's what Professor Mika Toba told me. Kazuma Asogi must stand as the defense attorney in today's trial. Good grief. Everything went exactly as the professor planned. P please lend me your wisdom, Asogi. You got it. For starters, do something about your shifty eyes and cold sweat. Stop it! Stop sweating all over it! If only if you just sing about your fluttery headband and cold gaze. <laughs> It just does this on its own. I don't know why. I keep trying to solve it and it won't do it. It keeps tickling the back of my neck. Hello there, butler man. When is please say your name and occupation of the court and how you murder this man? <laughs> Hosunaga. Certainly. My name is Sitaro Hosunaga. I'm a waiter at La Quantos, a restaurant serving Western cuisine. La Quantos? Sounds like more Hispanic restaurant. <coughs> oh, that's not good. Well, actually, I guess Hispanic would be west to, to ja Japan, wouldn't it? I, I guess. Uh, um, are you okay? There's blood dripping out of your mouth. No, no, this is wine. I'm just really fucked up. Oh, this is completely normal. I'm perfectly fine. Um, I'm not too sure about that. A few years ago, the southeastern corner of the capital was open to foreign se settlements. Now it's become a fashionable area, lined with hotels catering to visitors from abroad. 
crime occurred three days ago in that area at a restaurant specializing in Western cuisine. God damn, I look hot in this game. Who said that? No, oh, no, nothing. I'm just, I'm just watching now. I'm the the judge that is yet to be born. <laughs> I'm seeing, watching you from the great beyond. Witness, please share everything you know with the court. As you wish. <laughs> oh my God, it's so fucking hot in here. Try not to interrupt this man's testimony, amateur attorney. I'm warning you. Don't make me sick my pain train on you. Yes, sir. I never even called myself an attorney. Even though the name of the game is Ace Attorney, I'm not Ace Attorney! Just after 2 p.m. that day, we normally have few patrons at that hour. After the lunch rush, only three groups of customers remained. Come to think of it, he's right. There weren't many customers at the time. <laughs> oh, God. I was in the kitchen putting away the dishes, when suddenly I started coughing up blood! A gunshot rang out from the dining area. When I ran in under panic, I saw it. I saw the British gentleman, the victim, slumped over in his chair. Standing next to him was the defendant, holding a pistol. Hi! Hi! Wait! Please wait a second! Yes, I picked up the gun when I nosed it on the ground. But I but I swear to fire! Help! Help me a second! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> he even sat a little bit like me! Idiotic! Freaking not order! Nutty! None to scoff! And the council goes out of stock! Yaddy yaddy! So I'll throw out your rant! Holy ram Japanese lies you know, nigga! Save your breath, I've already warned you once! I will not hesitate to cut your fucking fat ass down! We're here to listen to the witness testimony! Now you're outburst, you amateur! No baby, come over there! But. God, this kid's such a scrub. <laughs> Next time you interrupt, be prepared to suffer a penalty! That's right, let's show, let's show them the HP bar! Get the HP bar, guys! Now, Rodo, you'll get your chance to strike back eventually. For now, listen to what his ma this man has to say as your bandana flutters in the breeze. But I don't have a bandana, Sugi! Well, I guess you're fucked! Ah! Uh. When S, there's one thing I would like to confirm. You saw the Q standing next to the victim with a pistol in hand, correct? This guy coughing because he like, like shot or something as well. Certainly, that is correct. I see. Mm. And apart from the accused, no one else was near the victim. Oh. Certainly not. Apart from the deceased British British gentleman and the defendant, no one else was present. Huh? Wait, what did you say? No. That's a lie! That's a lie! That's a no-no! No one else was present near the victim. What's the matter, Naruhodo? That's... That's not how I remember it. When I walked over to introduce myself to Dr. Watson... <gasps> there was a woman sitting in the chair across from him. What? There's no way the waiter missed that. Keep telling me not to interrupt, but can I just stand and watch this? No. Just wait and see what happens. No. Fuck this. Hi. Hi. <gasps> Give me this moment to do it myself. <laughs> ah, ah, sorry. I peed. I peed myself just a little bit. Doctor Watts, Watson wasn't sitting alone at the time. I'm certain that there was a woman dining with him. Idiotty! You shut your mouth, boy. My my, what a troublemaker. This attorney will stop at nothing to interfere with the trial. He's a little more than a fraud. I'm uh, sure that we can reasonably call the accused an attorney. Thank God we're playing my game. The great, I'm the greatest attorney, right? Me! Japanese paint! But, but... Witness, are you sure your memory isn't flawed? I certainly am. The British gentleman came to the restaurant by himself that day. But that's impossible! Stop coughing up blood on my beautiful podium! I made sure to discuss the seating arrangement of our patrons on this right here. I implore you to check for yourself. This appears to be a sketch of the crime scene. 
Since it was an emergency situation, I resorted to using the back of my business card. As you can see, this shows that the victim was alone at the time in question. You've gone above and beyond the call of duty. Truly, you are an admirable young waiter and totally not the person that killed this person. Oh, you know. You flatter me, your honor. I request that you present that sketch to the court as evidence for the trial. Oh, well. Is something wrong? Go on, hand it over! Hand it over! Uh, certainly, as you wish. That's odd. It's pretty calm up until now. They realized, oh shit, there's massive holes in that fucking uh, logic, right? <coughs> That's right. That waiter does seem to look a bit flustered. Oh my god, he is just blah, 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 blah. vomiting up blood. <coughs> this card's been filed in the court record. I need to look on the back, right? <coughs> and so, T pose! That summarized what happened during the incident. T pose pain here. Can I look at this? Details. I can. Oh! Ooh, look what I can do. Ooh, I can zoom. Whoa! Can't flip it over though. Oh! Oh, you see, you see words here, right? Hmm. Djelabida baba booba. Probably read that. It's got a. Just gotta turn the card around. When the gunshots ring out from the dining room, the only person near the victim was the accused. Why, I'd say we'll be wrapping this up. I trial up early day! Woo! Then we can all go to Goemon Land! Yeah! <laughs> Yay! That's what the old Meiji era amusement parks used to be like back in the day. Everybody knows that. Just read in the history books, guys. God, I do love going, on land. You're not going, you're not going in now! Oh, damn! Defend it. Ryunosuke Naruhodo. Yes, Your Honor. If you plead guilty now, the court is willing to recognize your plea as a mitigating factor. He means that your punishment may be reduced. Maybe! But probably not. Uh, beware, this one was only here to provide a summary of the incident. But if you insist on prolonging this trial, you're gonna die! The prosecution will gladly summon a decisive witness to the stand! Okay, now, maybe he's not the killer, but this one will definitely be the killer. Hey, Osogi, what should I do? What are you talking about? Quit fucking peeing your pants, Apollo! I mean, fucking Aro, no! Well, it sounds like I'm gonna be declared guilty sooner or later. So I think it might be best if I just plead guilty right now. Really, man? I mean, everyone's been talking about how special this trial is, right? You, Professor Mikotoba? Heck, even the judge at the prosecutor. If the trial keeps going on like this, I'm scared how it might end up. Motherfucker staring daggers at Naruto! <gasps> you said, what'd you say, motherfucker? I, I mean, I'm just saying, what did you say? Tell you to my face, I thought As I said before, the trial, at the trial, I believe in you, Naruto. And now, in spite of that, you intend to betray my good faith. Huh? The defendant is truly innocent. It's the defense attorney's duty to use any means necessary to prove it so. You have a duty to defend yourself. Are you going to abandon your duty? Even worse, you'll give up the battle when it's only just begun! The defense will continue to fight for an innocent verdict until the very end! <laughs> Look how it's fake. <laughs> Prosecution needs to stop stalling for time and it's more than a damn trial! Go ahead, call a so-called decisive witness to the stand! Ha! Very well. Prosecutor Al Alchi, continue as you were. Oh, how young and foolish you both are to not know your place in this court! They may call me a saint, but I'm prepared to become a fucking demon! Uh, Before long, I shall have your impudent little mouse seal permanently! Ah! <laughs> Whatever, man. Naruto's just getting warm. He's gonna fuck you up, right, Naruto? Dude, stop trying to pump me up, man. Yeah! Yeah, look at him! Look at him, he's sweating. He's so fucking confident. He's so fucking confident, he's just shitting himself right now. He's so ready to fuck you up, Archie. Oh, yeah? You think you're beating up, do you? Do you, Naruto? I really don't, really! My smile is gone. 
The prosecution will call two witnesses to the stand. What two the fuck witnesses? That's way too many witnesses for a single first case. That's right, you're only supposed to have like two people and one of them's obviously the killer. <laughs> now, bear lift! Konnichiwa, young Uji! It is I, Japanese k k k Meda, in the house! Bring in the prosecutor's witness. Nani? Okay, non deska Kameda san shall go and fetch the- Just get the fuck out over there! <laughs> okay, fine. What the fuck? Oh, it's the guy with the head! Witnesses, please say your names and occupations to the court. Yes, sir. I'm the proud soldier of the Empire, Sergeant Taizu Uzu Kumaru, sir. Not this one is but a peddler of time. I'm gonna knock. I've got a pinhead! An antiquary, one brings to the Imperial Capital the essence of curios from bygone eras. Ah, why am I still alive? I've been alive for three centuries now, I just want to die! Owner of the Hall of Discard Emporium on the corner of the Capitol's second block. Sanman Sono Ugarashi is my name. It's a fucking mouthful. The antique dealer and a soldier. What an odd combination. These two were also in the restaurant on the day of the incident, Your Honor. So this is the third group of customers the waiter was referring to earlier. This one spends a brief time each afternoon enjoying the aromatic coffee in Las Cuantas. Ooh, ooh. Look at this little funny thing, I tell you what. Oftentimes, this one also converses with connoisseurs and interested in my treasures. And also, this one will occasionally converse with voices inside his head that tell him to murder people. I have no idea what he's talking about. The old man owns an antique shop. It appears to be a regular Las Cuantas. He tries to sell his antiques to any customers who look like they would be interested. Many affluent socialites dine at that high-class Western establishment, after all. Oh, I see. If I'm being honest, a soldier there doesn't seem affluent enough to be buying much of anything. So, the two of you witnessed with the very moment that this heinous crime unfolded. Is that correct? Y yes, sir! Yes, sir! No! The insolence is such an atrocity! No d d detail of any of this owner's watchful eyes! Indeed! Without a doubt, what's that sound? Ah! Without a doubt, that juvenile clad in somber black fire the leaves around! Nope, I don't understand this guy either. I just think he doesn't like me. But putting that aside, I think I heard a strange sound just now. Yeah, what's that? I see. It's two of the so called decisive witnesses. The soldier said he witnessed the very moment you shot the victim. Huh? So, are you having fun yet? Honestly, I'm about to be so blah! Good. That means you're ready. What? Now, let's hear your testimony. Tell the court the truth of what you witnessed during the incident. As he was, Todd and Tizer, who's my car? Point for duty, what's that start again? Ah! Alas, this one does not wish to recall the deplorable events of that afternoon. I just wish to sit here and stare at, uh, weirdly at my little face. Ooh, it's so fucking brown and shiny. What is that, All right, what we witnessed? I was at the restaurant chatting with the old man as I ate my beefsteak. This one was boasting of a beautiful treasure enveloped in golden gleam. And then... <laughs> the flash of a gunshot! That moment was burned into my eyes! I'm trying to like listen, what, what is this sound that keeps, that keeps popping out? A black clad student shot the British man, a sudden cowardly shot from behind! Meanwhile, this one crawled to the floor in search of a treasure gone missing. I didn't care about what was happening. That means, Sergeant, you must have witnessed the crime in its entirety. Everything from when the accused took the pistol to when he shot the victim. Indeed! The despicable culprit! Oh, yeah, it's just... I don't think he's making that noise. The despicable culprit was the delinquent of a student over there! 
I'm gonna stab motherfucker out here. Yeah! That's right, you come up in my neighborhood, you're gonna get some. I'm gonna gut you like a pig boy. I mean, I mean well, I'm sorry. I, I, I mean, uh, yes. Yeah, so I'm the rabbit boy with shooting English man at such an insensitive juncture. I could probably kill somebody with this, right? Yeah! Wait, that's not true. I didn't shoot anyone. Sure about that, Naruto. All I did was pick up a pistol from the floor like a dumbass! I was like, hey, what's this doing here? After introducing myself to Dr. Watson, I went to my table to finish my coffee. Then, I decided to go home. So I made my way to the door. I saw a bridge made pistol on the ground next to where the doctor was sitting. Ooh, neat! I thought that he might have accidentally dropped it, so I picked it up. But just as I was about to hand it to him... BANG! Actually shot him in the FACE! That's really what happened. The true culprit is still at large. And the clue to their identity rests within this testimony! Really? Quickly, Naruto! Draw, a, draw your sword! Assert your right to, to conduct a cross-examination! Cross-examination! There's no time to waste! Slime up! Now then, as you just heard, Your Honor, there's nothing to be fucking done! Just give up! This testimony has conclusively proven the accused guilt. The time is, the time has come, and so am I to pass judgment on this despicable university student! Indeed. There is no longer any room for doubt. Nobody can do anything else. Bye! Alright, gonna wrap this up! Gonna swing my gavel! Here I come. Well then, the court hereby concludes. Hi! I'm raising my hand, you can't do anything! Oh, my hand's raised. What was that? What's this, uh, this unbearable awkward silence? Stop it! Stop it right now! Hi. Hi. No. The defense... Demands the right to conduct the cross-examination thing! Really? Oh dear, you told him about that, didn't you? Damn it! Ah, oh, we were all about to go out to lunch, guys! Looks like going my Lance gonna have to wait! What are you, a puppet? Are these your words, or those of the man next to you? Uh, he got me. Prosecution objects. It's clearly a ploy to waste everyone's dumb demon time. One cannot accept, expect such an inexper inexperienced attorney to conduct a cross-examination. Regardless, the defense has every right to make such a demand. Regardless of him being an inexperienced weeb, he is totally gonna do this shit. Experience or lack thereof matters not. Soki, that was amazing. God, I wish I had a sword. Very well. I hereby grant the defense's request to conduct cross-examination. Excellent. Now the real battle begins. But I have no idea what to do in a cross-examination. It's all right. Just remember all the other games, Apollo. What? Why are you calling me that now? I'm not Apollo. And what other games are we talking about? Simple. Expose the lies in their testimony. Huh? You didn't fire that pistol, therefore someone must be lying. That makes sense. The key to the truth rests within the evidence. The evidence. That thing-a-dinger. To expose our lies, you must strike with them with an incisive piece of evidence. <laughs> ah! Like that! Like a fucking crying chop! Anyway, just try your best, Ace Attorney! That's right. <laughs> Got it! Oh, I hurt my hands when I did it. <laughs> like he goes, all right, I can do that. <laughs> Get my hands down. Just a little smack. Ow. Uh, God, you got little girly hands. Because I have no choice but to go. Go for it. Go that far. All right. Bring it on, Max Payne, whatever your name is. All right. Well, you know what, guys? I think I'm going to end it here for now. Uh, it's good so far. It's good. It's, <laughs> I mean, you know, we're in all the same beats. It's very much a fucking Ace Attorney game. I haven't really thrown any curveballs at us yet, but it looks fucking good. Music sounds really good, too. Like, it honestly looks better than Spirit of Justice, I think. Like, goddamn. But yeah, let me know what you guys uh, think so far. If you want to see more of this Let's Play, if you do, please leave a like and a favorite. It really does help me out. And subscribe if you're not ready to become a Peaky Penguin. For the SLP, where the days are always sunny and the vids are always funny. And let me know what uh, you think of the voices I picked so far. If you have some suggestions or you'd rather I kind of 
tweak or change some things, uh, I can do that. So just uh, let me know in the comments down below. And I just want to say, if uh, you enjoy this content and you want to help me continue to make more videos like these, uh, please consider becoming a patron over on my Patreon. Even if just a dollar per month really does go a long way to help me bring you guys the best content possible. And of course, to all my patrons over on Patreon, seriously, thank you guys so much. You guys are truly the reason why I'm able to continue to do what I do. So seriously, from the bottom of my heart, thank you. And of course, the same goes to my Twitch subscribers too, which is another way if you decide you want to do it that way, but that one is, starts at a minimum of $5. But you do get some emotes, and if you join the Discord, you can use the emotes there too. So, But anyway, guys... As always, till next time, stay classy!